gives his extra 2,000. You've heard stories of identical twins who grow up, look exactly the same, and live remarkably similar lives. But one set of twins we met with lived very differently. And the way it affected their looks could teach a lesson to all of us. Scott Rappaport has the story. Ever since they were little girls, Gay and Gwen Verbit have been getting those knowing stares that all identical twins do. We look so much alike that we can't even tell ourselves apart in the old pictures. And today, at the age of 62, you can still hardly tell these retired nurses apart. They both had plastic surgery and they both look great. But up until a few years ago, before the surgery, Gay and Gwen looked radically different from each other. That was Gwen, and this was Gay. Gay's face more heavily lined, the creases around her eyes and mouth deeper than her sister's, her appearance older. The difference is astonished both, particularly Gay. It was a real shocker. I didn't like it at all. Well, the presumption would be that if they're genetically identical, that they should age virtually alike. But I think the genes are highly overrated. There are other factors. Dr. Derek Antel is the twins' plastic surgeon and author of a recent study on twins that attributes differences in their aging process to the lifestyle choices they make. What we found in this study is that some of the twins did not age at the same rate. The main reasons? Smoking, sun exposure, stress, alcohol. Dr. Antel says the case of Gwen and Gay provides a perfect example. Gay, you'll recall, was the older-looking twin. Did you smoke? I smoked marijuana for seven years. Did you drink? I drank lots of wine and beer for ten years. Spend time in the sun? Lots of time in the sun. Stress? I was working about 100 hours a week. I worked four jobs consecutively. Gwen, the younger-looking twin, lived a decidedly calmer life. She says she never smoked, hardly ever drank, and spent much less time in the sun than her sister. Did you have any idea that all these factors could play such a role? I think I knew it, but I didn't care. Clearly, avoiding things like sun, booze, smoking, and stress is not a revolutionary concept. But Dr. Antel says the study is a significant one. It's the first one that I'm aware of that really proves that your lifestyle choices will impact how rapidly you age. Dr. Antel says to reduce the risk of rapid aging, avoid things like smoking, excessive sun, eat right, and exercise. All the things mom always told you.